Hey everyone, this is username Evil Tick. <clears throat> I um, just uploaded some videos to my Evil Tick 13 channel. And I'm going to be putting a lot more videos on that channel also. Um, hopefully, I've been talking about this for what, two years now? Hopefully I'm getting a Volkswagen pretty soon. I can start tearing it apart and fixing it up and drive it and everything. But I had a video on this channel called uh, Best Neighbor Ever or Greatest Neighbor or something like that. And uh, I never did uh, shoot a video about the, uh, the last set of cameras he gave me before I left to come to Texas. So everybody, you know, most everybody knows, and if you don't, as the story goes, I lived in Virginia up until what, three months ago, something like that, um, and moved to Texas. And while I was in Virginia, we had a big piece of land, small house, cool neighbor. We only had really one neighbor. Um, when we moved here, we got a little piece of land with a big house. I have a bunch of neighbors, and they're all nice, you know, normal. Hey, hey, neighbor, how you doing? <clears throat> and uh, so I miss my neighbor. <laughs> In the other video, I showed the uh, the Roly 16 he gave me. Yeah, so you can look at that video if you want to see that one. It came with a cool lens and everything. Don't take this wrong way, he didn't just like give me stuff and every time I went over he just kept giving me stuff. I gave him stuff, but as far as I'm concerned, he gave me way better, way more stuff than I gave him. Uh, I made out like a, a bandit. And in this case, <clears throat> um, I'll show this camera in the bag in a second. I want to show this um, 16 millimeter Minolta um, first. But um, in this case, for this camera bag and this camera up here, I told him I didn't want it. He said, do you like it? I was like, yeah, I like it. It's nice. But I don't want it. You keep it. He's like, why? I was like, yeah, you need a camera too. He goes, oh, i got cameras and made me take it. Well, back in the back of my mind, I'm going, yes, I want that. Give it to me. So <clears throat> at any rate, he gave me this other 16-millimeter uh, camera. It's a Minolta. All right, you can change the speeds and everything on the side. Go 3.5 to 11, 25, 50, and 200 speed. So, uh, then when you push this little thing here, it opens up. You can put your film in there. And every time you, every time you open it, it advances the film. So if you open it, you don't take a picture. I believe, I don't know, it may not advance the film until you drop the shutter. Just take a picture and do that over and over again. And what's cool about this one, it came with, or he gave me this flash. And the little mounting deal goes on there like this. And this flash is like 10 times cooler than the camera. I love this old stuff. Even even has the books still with it, the manual. Crazy. How retro is that? Just and then the last piece comes out of here and hooks. Slide it into the cold shoe that you just put on the camera. And then you plug it in right here in the back. And now you have a really cool flash. Your camera how cool is that very cool I'll tell you how cool that is that's very cool all right so all that goes in that bag and this goes back in here all right on to the other other camera this was the last camera he gave me and I'm still trying to get his address I, I emailed him through Facebook I was like give me your address I guess I'm gonna send you and I haven't got it yet and I think uh, part of it might be He's like, no, no, he's going to send me something. Cause every time I'd give him something, he'd give me something. I'm like, yeah. I'm just, yeah. So, uh, he gave me some film, which was cool, because you can never have enough film. And he gave me this camera with a flash. And it's a cold shoe. You got to plug the um, flash into the side here. Mamma Mia. Maya Mia, uh, Mamma Mia, 
Mamia, Mamia, I don't know. Secor, uh, Secor, 500 TL. Uh, hopefully, out of all those pronunciations, I got it right at least once. If not, <laughs> I don't really care. So, it's right there. So, uh, it has a wide angle lens on it 28 millimeter, 1.25 or 2.5 Vivitar. And, uh, takes two hands to open it but luckily when I was born I was born with two hands so there's the inside of the camera advance when you, you, know, you advance the film push this button when you are done and it closes the handle push this button to take the picture and then uh, all your settings are right here. Pretty cool camera. Really cool camera. But not only did I get the camera in this wicked cool retro Starsky and Hutch Air um, strap, which I really like this strap a lot. I got this cool bag. He gave me the bag. I was like, man, that bag is cool. But inside the bag was a camera thing for the wide angle lens, made in Japan. I put the 52 millimeter that was on the camera in there. And it's, uh, this is the M-A-M-I-Y-A-S-E-K-O-R lens. And it's a uh, two, oh, 50 millimeter, my bad. Why did I say 52 millimeter? Oh, there's a 52 millimeter threaded uh, glass deal on it. Alright. So, yeah, got this lens for it in this really cool carrying case. And then we got this lens that was in there also, which is a 90 to 230 millimeter um, Vivitar. Tele zoom 9230 millimeter 4.5. So you're only going to use it outside, and that's about it. You're not going to use it indoors. Heavy lens, too. That's pretty neat. I'm waiting to go on another cruise so I can use this camera. And uh, I'll use it around here, but not this long lens because it's really nothing I can't walk up to here. But that is so cool. The case is cool. Carrying strap. Camera's cool. The bag is cool. My neighbor was cool. Um, now don't get me wrong, I got nice neighbors around here. Um, I was telling my neighbor across the street how uh, hopefully I'll be getting a Volkswagen bug in the next week or two. And then I would have to rent a uh, I'll have to rent a truck and a trailer to get the bug because my truck doesn't have a tow hitch. And he said, oh, why well, you gotta run a truck? And he points to his truck and I'm like, oh, I really appreciate that, but I don't want I don't want to put you out, you know? Uh, yeah, it's a, it could be an hour long drive to go get it. And he said, as long as you do it on the weekend, I can go with you. I'm like, all right, cool. So well, I do still have, you know, 50% of your neighbors and that you have are going to be cool. The other 50% are just going to be god awful. Um, but, so I have a cool neighbor, but I still miss the neighbors and friends I had in Virginia. But, yeah, there's my update video to my coolest neighbor ever video. And check out Evil Tig 13 channel. I'm trying to put a link down below or in this channel. Two videos there. Um, I did a night driving video with uh, my 50 millimeter lens on my Sony NEX and we just rambled. We went out late one night like 11 to 30 at night to get some hamburgers or a hamburger and chicken biscuits from Whataburger. So I decided this would be a good chance to see what this lens will do in a less country setting at night. You know, and you can see the clouds in the sky. It's pretty cool. You can check it out. Um, all right, everyone take care.